A quick discussion about the spur. Um, the placement of the spur um, should be in this position right above the sole. Um, when you have a boot that has a spur rest, uh, we don't want to put the spur on that because it means that when you use the leg, you're always going to have to use your spur. So with the spur placed like this, sometimes you can use your, your heel. Oh, oh boy. You know, and if you want the spur, you can just turn your toe out. So you can um, do either. Um, we don't always want to use the spur anyway. Ah, good. And also, why do we use the spur? We use the spur to either yield the horse, to move it over, or we use the spur to lift the back and round the horse. Good boy. Um, we don't ever want to use the spur for go. If you use the spur for a lazy horse, instead of trying to solve why the horse doesn't want to go forward, but you, we use the spur, particularly set on the spur rest all the time, uh, that uh, will actually make the horse duller, make the horse go less, uh, because if it's not going forward, it's behind the leg. So pushing with the spur isn't going to do it. You have to figure out why the horse doesn't want to go forward. Uh, but the placement is um, very important. I often see in clinics uh, people with the spur much too high, and it's always on the horse, and that makes it not mean anything.